So all the different law enforcement agencies in Metro Atlanta have the same goal, keeping all of us safe, but they all have some different specialties it, for that. We did. We learned that that came into play when Atlanta police and the Georgia State Patrol teamed up to catch a pair of suspected robbers. CBS 46's reporter Melissa Stern explains how it works. Thanks to the Atlanta Police Department and Georgia State Patrol troopers, two robbers who cops believe stole from innocent victims outside of this apartment complex are now off the street. I, I hate it for the victims that it happened, and I'm glad those two guys off the street. Those who live near the Apex West Midtown Apartments on Huff Road say it's alarming to hear that a pizza delivery man and the security guard on duty were robbed at gunpoint. We found two victims. One advised he was sitting in his vehicle when a black male approached, opened the door to the vehicle, produced a handgun, and demanded his money. Security, sometimes he's posted up over there. Police say around 11.20 p.m. on December 15th, the two victims were robbed of their cell phones and wallets. That's when the suspect bolted to a red four-door vehicle with dark tints and no lights. Police patrolling the Piedmont Road corridor found the car that matched that description a couple hours later. They attempted to stop the vehicle and the vehicle fled from them. They actually disengaged. They, they stopped the pursuit at that point. And uh, around several minutes later, they saw the vehicle traveling on I-75 northbound and they began following the vehicle. At that point, they requested the assistance of the Georgia State Patrol. Some of them have a lot more training when it comes to pursuits than we do. So they're a great partner to have in cases like this. So we do request their assistance quite frequently. Unbeknownst to the suspects, there were troopers awaiting their arrival at Northside Parkway and the I-75 northbound ramp. It ended at 118 West Wesley Road Northwest due to the vehicle wrecking. That makes me feel very safe. You know, it means they're doing their job. Oh. Uh, of course, I'll be, uh, be watching my bag every time I walk in at late night. I come in about two, I work nights, so I'll be watching my bag every time I come in. 25-year-old Terrell Smith is charged with aggravated assault, armed robbery, reckless driving, and possession of a firearm. 20-year-old Deshaun Williams is charged with conspiracy to commit a crime and obstruction of officers. A handgun along with the victim's stolen items were located, and the vehicle was found to be stolen out of another jurisdiction. Reporting in Atlanta, I'm Melissa Stern, CBS 46 News.